They're the baddest guys you've ever known. I'll pull your hair. I'll steal your phone. They like to bite and kick and punch. I'll scare your dog. I'll eat your lunch. The super villains you hate to love and love to hate. Now stay right where you are. This is going to be so great. What's up, super villain fans? It's your favorite clown with the upside down frown, the Joker. Oh no, gotcha! Ah, you. Oh. oh. I dropped it. I wanted that gear moved hours ago. You are literally the bane of my existence. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I crack myself up. Sorry, Joker. <sighs> All right. Now, where was I? Viewers, you're in for a treat. Today, I'll be unboxing the latest release from Bat Brain Inc. Face it. Bat Brain has a long history of questionable releases, but maybe they've learned from their past mistakes. Only one way to find out. <laughs> oh, I guess I'm supposed to be impressed. I know they're going for a premium vibe, but to me it reads trying too hard. I agree. The packaging is clean and direct, but the product itself just leaves me feeling, oh, I don't know, underwhelmed? <laughs> don't worry, Joker. When I get out of here, I'm sure you'll find I'm much more impactful. It talks! <laughs> cool feature! Bat Brain does it again! Nevertheless, I give it, hmm, uh, one out of five stars. <laughs> Watch it. Okay, friends, now it's time for the segment I like to call the Ice Batman Challenge. Everybody's doing it. Ice to see you, Batman. Nice try, Freeze. I'm wearing my thermal bat suit. Your frosty tricks don't bother me at all. Regardless, you won't be getting out of there anytime soon. Ah! Oh, well, that was fun! As predicted, I'm the winner of the Ice Batman Challenge. I can feel the lights just rolling in. My bad. Oh, for crying. Bane, don't make me put you in timeout. Ugh. Moving on. It's time for everyone's favorite, the Ghost Pepper Challenge! You've seen it before, but we add a neat twist. Oh, perfect. I've got jalapeno poppers right here. Uh, you muscle-bound half-wit! We don't have time for snacks! Ooh, I'll take one. Like I was saying, the Ghost Pepper Challenge! Don't try this at home, kids. To win this challenge, the boy Blunder has to survive a dip in the boiling hot pepper sauce without turning into a ghost. <laughs> You're out of your mind, Joker. Yes, yes I am. You have to be out of your mind to enjoy scorching your taste buds with sizzling hot pepper sauce. Oh, hot, oh, it's hot. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, that's hot. Oh, my eyes! They're burning! That's the power of the hottest pepper on Earth, melting your face! Ha! Oh, please don't mention melting. It makes me uncomfortable. Your criminal antics won't get you anywhere, Joker. I've defeated you countless times, and I'll do it again. Ha! Don't make me laugh, Betty Boy. I don't see any way you're getting out of this one. And as for you, Freeze, why do you take orders from this pathetic clown? He clearly doesn't appreciate you. You know what? You're right. I never get an actor boy or good job, and he's always calling me nasty names. I do not, you flash frozen nincompoop. The supervillain lifestyle is its own reward. You should be thanking me! Watch your tongue, clown, or face the wrath of my freeze ray. Oh, no! What 
what shall I do? Is the mean man in the silly spacesuit going to give me a cold? <laughs> Look what you've done, you doofus! <sighs> Batman, hang on! I'll get you free. I never doubted you. Thanks, and great job distracting those two. Freeze! Freeze them! Look out, Freeze. There's an iceberg on the horizon. Go! Hang on, Batman. I'm gonna get you out of there! Ugh. Well, there goes my hot sauce. Joker, I give this video a giant thumbs down. Ooh. Well, I give it a big thumbs up! <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, Batman's back! <laughs> you really are infuriating, you know. It's my brand. <laughs> cool moves, Batman. You've got that right, Robin. A little too cool for comfort sometimes. Good work taking down Freeze. And your hot sauce stunt? Top notch. Well, I guess this is Super Villain TV signing off. <laughs> That's right, Joker. I'm sending both of you to chill out in Arkham Asylum. Batman, I just want you to know, I've always appreciated your leadership style. And I appreciate your appreciation. Thanks, everyone. That's a wrap. Wait, do I have to go to Arkham too? The super villains you hate to love and love to hate. We'll be back! At a much later date. <laughs>
Not the kind of switch we're looking for. Definitely not. Hey, I just remembered a classic first grade joke. What's a pirate's favorite letter? I... I don't know. Arr! <laughs> Not bad. Oh, that's a terrible joke. But you could be on to something. Rats, it didn't work. What else starts with R? Roger. As in, Jolly Roger! Oh, give me a hand, Batman. Thanks. Not feeling so jolly now, are you? Better hurry up. Time's a ticking. Uh-oh, we only have one minute. I think you're on the right track, Nightwing. Remember, the riddle mentions letters, plural. But it's not the letters of the compass, and it's not the letter R. So what is it? I'll show you. Watch this. Great job, Batman. But uh, how'd you solve it? A pirate has two favorite letters, Nightwing. The first is R, and the second is the C. And you thought my joke was bad. Ugh. <sighs> they figured it out? That's impossible! Curse you, Batman! I was certain this was the end for you! Wait a minute. It looks like they're coming straight for the control room. I better skedaddle fast. <laughs> nice try, Riddler. Like I said, there's no puzzle you can devise that I can't solve. Blah, blah. No one likes a show off. Yeah! I think it's time for you two to walk the plank. Yeah! Watch out, Nightwing. <laughs> like you said, the Riddler is always full of surprises. Yeah! Hiya! Are your timbers shivering yet, Batman? Far from it, Riddler. Good work, Nightwing. Now that the tables are turned, I've got a riddle for you. What's something provided for free that still costs you a lot? Hmm. I don't know. Answer? A one-way ticket back to Arkham Asylum. Right, because you're not charging for the ride, yet I'm paying with my punishment. I gotta admit, that's a good one. Nevertheless, I'll get you next time, Batman. Talk about a last minute escape. It'll take a lot more than that for a supervillain to sink us. Look, I got a souvenir. Avast ye scurvy dogs! Arrgh! Uh. I think you should just stick to fighting crime. <laughs> Thanks for the withdrawal, ladies and gents. I'll pay you back. Never! <laughs> huh. Not so fast, Harley. Your account is overdrawn. Well, if it isn't my least favorite crime-fighting duo, got the cash, but I think I'm gonna charge it instead. <laughs> Have a nice trip. Good one, Robin. Ow! Slam dunk. Anyone get the license number of that mallet? You're out of circulation, Harley. Next stop, Arkham Asylum. Another criminal plot foiled, and it's not even 9 a.m. Uh-oh, Batman. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? On the contrary. I'm not seeing what you're not seeing. The Batmobile is gone! <laughs> well, what do we have here? I do believe I've stumbled upon the Batwagon left unattended, while the dynamic dum-dums are foiling a bank robbery. What luck! And it's not even 9 a.m. What? Unlocked? And no security alarms? It's too good to be true! <laughs> now, Where's the start button? <laughs> Strange. I could have sworn I parked right here. You did. And I have the app to prove it. Thank you for parking. You have 15 minutes remaining before you get towed. Well done, Robin. 
Even though we're heroes, it's important to respect the law and always pay for parking. Yeah, the app makes it simple. But where's the Batmobile? Do you think it was <gasps> stolen? <laughs> I can't believe it. I've got the Dark Knight's dumb detective's wheels. And this thing runs like a dream. Listen to that motor purr. And look at all these gizmos. Grappling hook, smoke screen, snack bar. Ooh, what's this button do? <laughs> I'll remind me to buy one of these. Say, I need to go show this thing off. I swear, if I have to go back to Arkham and the Wi-Fi is still broken, I'll lose my mind. You've already lost your mind. Hmm. True. Hey, you guys, uh, want to get coffee? Ah! It's Batman! Scatter! <laughs> What's up, losers? Looks like you're just hanging out, twiddling your thumbs while not stealing your arch rival's car. Whoa. You didn't. Oh, yes, I did. <laughs> Ooh, can I give it a spin? I always wanted to check out the sound system. I bet it slaps. Oh, no can do, Baney boy. I've got things to do, people to torment. You know how it is. Always on my hustle. Hashtag villain life. Slap you later, dingbats. Must be nice. Don't worry. I'm sure it's a trap. So, coffee? <laughs> Listen for the beep when we get close. Wait a minute. Don't you have a tracker on the Batmobile? Of course I do, Robin. And a remote control? Indeed. So, what are we doing here? Looks like I've got a confession to make. Hmm, I'm feeling a bit peckish. Oh look, a drive through Guess I'll just... Drive on through! <laughs> I'll take it all! To go! <laughs> Whew! That is one sweet ride! I'm sure I can get up to all kinds of shenanigans behind the wheel of this beauty! Keep dreaming, Joker! We're here to put your shenanigans on hold! Oh look! Batman and Robin are here to ruin my fun! Again! You're a couple of wet blankets. How did you find me anyway? Bat Tracker. You fell right into our trap. Enabling us to discover the location of your secret lair with ease. <laughs> no need to be mad. I didn't get a scratch on her. Maybe you'd accept a peace offering? How about a double cheeseburger? <laughs> Once again, you've earned yourself a ride straight back to Arkham. Curse you! I just wanted to have a little fun! Sorry, Joker. Crime doesn't pay. As I suspected, the source of the signal is definitely coming from this house. What are we looking for, Batman? The frequency I'm detecting is cycling at an alarming rate. I'm afraid. Someone has crime on their mind. The only thing that makes me afraid is this house. Oh, and that rat. Let's proceed with caution, Robin. There's no telling what we'll find. I guess that's why they call it Chill House. Yeah, this place is definitely haunted. <laughs> oh, Robin, there's no such thing as haunted. Even the most unusual events have logical explanations. I don't think Gentleman Ghost would agree. You've got a point. Let's stay alert. Oh, chill house, huh? I'm getting chills, all right. It's freezing in here. Did you know sudden changes in temperature and pockets of cold air are often signs of a haunting? The house is of late 19th century design, Robin. I'm sure it hasn't been updated with modern heating technology. Yeah, sure. Or it's haunted. See if you can find a light switch. Roger that. Good work. The signal is coming from the top of the stairs. Keep your eyes peeled for anything unusual. Batman, everything about this place is unusual. Did you know that flickering lights can be evidence of a ghostly presence? 
I'll admit that the house is fairly macabre, and I certainly wouldn't want to spend the night here. But as far as ghost stories go, most of them are nothing but figments of the imagination. Look out, Batman! <sighs> Thanks, Robin. That was close. Are you still sure we're not dealing with ghosts? Look, it's just an empty suit of armor. No spooks here. Crime, on the other hand, is still afoot. Let's go. Looks like we've reached the library, and the signal is getting stronger. It sure is dusty in here. And what's that smell? Hmm. It smells like something's burning. Unusual smells are another sign of- A haunting? Let me ease your mind. During an investigation, it's important to pay careful attention to your surroundings. The draft in the entrance hall came from an open window. The flickering lights were caused by a combination of lightning and old wiring. And the burning smell. Why, that's this fireplace, of course. The source of the signal is coming from directly behind it. If I know anything about haunted houses, nothing is ever what it seems at first glance. Great job, Robin. Just paying careful attention to my surroundings. Oh, yes, this house and its outdated electrical system. I can't generate enough power. And without sufficient energy, I won't be able to freeze Gotham City. Freeze? Of course. The signal is coming from his cryotech machine. It all makes sense now. We need to take out the machine before Freeze can reach full power. Allow me. Hey, careful, Robin. The floor is frozen, and black ice is extremely dangerous. Good thing I'm extremely extreme. This is the last time I ordered parts from Gotham City Discount Warehouse. Hands off the controls, huh? Freeze. <laughs> time to put you on ice. Uh, that's my line. Uh, hey, no sir. Why can't you just leave me alone to my work? I won't rest until the citizens of Gotham City learn what it's like to suffer a frozen fate. Sorry, Freeze. I can't let you do that. Ha! Your heroic antics are pointless, Batman. Yes. <laughs> Batman. A little help? <laughs> I've got you right where I want you. Yeah. Oh no! Now what? Don't worry, Robin. I'll have us out of here in no time. Now, where was I? Let's try these new calculations. If I lower the gain frequency here, while siphoning 10% power from the auxiliary cryo motor. Yes! Yes! It's finally working! I've got a thermo laser tailor made for this situation. Wait! It's too much power! If I don't stop it, my plans will be ruined! Ah! There you go, Freeze. An ice prison just for you. Uh, I don't understand why it didn't work. My calculations were perfect. Not perfect enough, Freeze. Now you get to cool your heels back at Arkham. Here's what's curious, Robin. From what I can tell, Freeze had the correct sequence to power his machine. <sighs> I guess luck was on our side tonight. <laughs> Come on, Robin, a little bit higher. Let me see some elbow grease. Settle down, Nightwing. I got everything under control. Whoa! whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> I meant to do that. Very nice. You know any other tricks? The banner looks great. I think Batman is really gonna like it. Definitely. I'm glad we could put together this party to thank him for everything he's done for Gotham City. I hope he appreciates it. I'm not sure he likes all the attention. Well, at least there's cake. Well, what do you know? Someone's planning a big party for Batsy Watsy. That guy gets all the attention. I deserve a party too. What is that stinking back got that I ain't got? I'm the whole package. First of all, I'm cute. Second of all, I'm cuddly. And third of all, I'm a few cards short of a full deck. <laughs>
Yeah, Batman really grinds my gears too. Hey, back off. <laughs> Sorry. Don't sneak up on a girl like that. Who are you anyway? Seriously? <laughs> you don't recognize me? Vest man? No. Big gloves guy. Uh-uh. Ah, budget ninja. No. Sorry, I guess I forgot. I'm Red Hood. Oh, that's right. You're the guy that does the thing. What is it you do again? I'm a vigilante. So you're a supervillain? Well, not exactly. But you hate Batman. Consider us frenemies. Yeah, sounds complicated. Tell me something, Mr. Hood. You want to help me ruin Batman's party? Well, I think that's everything. Maybe we should check all the rides and attractions, just to be sure everything is safe before the kids arrive. That's a great idea. <laughs> when the jumpers start jumping, they'll be in for a big surprise. Devilishly clever. And devilishly delightful. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's give this a try. One, two, whoa! We may have overinflated those things. Uh, just a touch. <laughs> <laughs> Let's make sure the playground is secure. Sounds good. Dibs on swings. Seems okay so far. Yeah. The kids are gonna love. Whoa! Nightwing, look out! Whoa! Something suspicious is going on, Nightwing. I'm sure we checked earlier and everything was safe and secure. I think someone's been tampering with the equipment. Agreed. Let's get this area fixed up and do a little investigating. Someone definitely overinflated these bouncy houses, Robin. And someone removed the screws on the playground. Good thing we checked. Someone could have gotten really hurt. Well, the party is starting soon. We better get ready for the citizens of Gotham City to show up. Hey, Nightwing, do you remember setting up that booth? No. It looks like fun, though. Want to give it a shot? I'm not so sure. Huh. The Harley Quinn and Red Hood target dummies are extremely lifelike. Uh, I ain't no dummy. Let's get him! Oh! <laughs> Nice work, Nightwing. <laughs> you said it. Up top. Yeah. I guess it's time to take out the trash. Yeah, we need to clean up before the party begins. Oh no! Where'd they go? <clears throat> that darn bat! He's such a party pooper. I found her escaping the park. What's going on here? Just a little bouncy house playground ball pit battle. NBD. But uh, hey. Didn't you see Red Hood? No Red Hood. Just the delightful Miss Harley Quinn. Well, I'll show you delightful. What's this? A party for me? Yeah, of course it's a party for you, Batsy Wattsy. It's all the parties. Meanwhile, the real party pranksters like me get nothing. I'll consider you a party favor for Arkham Asylum. Let's go. Wait, Batman, you can't leave now. The party's about to start. Yeah, can't you see how much planning we did? Thanks to you both. I appreciate the sentiment, but crime never sleeps. I'll take care of Harley and return as soon as I can. But... but... Aww, I wanted cake! What's taking Batman so long? I'm worried that once we serve dessert, everyone's gonna leave. Hey, you finally made it! Great! We can finally bust out the cake! No cake for me, thanks. Unfortunately, buttercream frosting isn't on this crime fighter's menu. <sighs> I've still got my eye on you, Dark Knight. Next time, I'll serve you up to all your guests. Eh, but in the meantime... <laughs> Yeah!
Yes! I nearly finished loading these gas canisters filled with my special evolution agent. Then I'll drive this train directly to Central City and turn all its citizens into primates! <laughs> Why do villains always give away their evil plans? I thought you were known for your intelligence, Grodd. What are you doing here in Gotham, Grodd? This isn't your turf. Sometimes, one must get out of his natural habitat to get his work done effectively. Well, next time, work from home. I had a feeling you'd show up, Batman. So I came prepared. It's easy to capture your prey when you have the right tool. Say your prayers, Dark Knight. You'll never get away with this, Grodd. <laughs> That's what you think. You're about to take a ride on me. The Extinction Express. <laughs> Next stop, Batman becomes Flatman! I've got to get out of this net. We're in big trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Whew. Looks like I got here right on time. Another nanosecond and I would have been history. Well, good thing I measure everything in nanoseconds. Did I get him? I think I got him. Yes, I must have no more Batman. <laughs> Next stop, Central City Station. <laughs> How did you know I needed help? To be honest, I didn't. Commuters in Central City were complaining that the Gotham City Express train wasn't running, so the first thing I did was give you a call. Yeah, I get terrible service down here. So when you didn't pick up, I decided to just come down and check it out myself. It's honestly faster than a phone call. I'm sure you didn't expect to find me all tied up. You can thank Gorilla Grodd for that. Grodd? I should have known. And he's behind the controls of that subway train that just zoomed away. We need to move. Now! Hey, moving is my specialty. Quick, give me a boost onto the train. Quick's my middle name. I'll take care of Grodd. Meanwhile, you race ahead and figure out how to stop this train. Copy, copy. Yes! We're getting closer! Now approaching Central City Station. All is going according to plan. Once we arrive in Central City, I will unleash my evolution agent on the populace. All humans that are exposed will evolve into great apes, a superior species, and all under my command! <laughs> I have to be cautious. Grodd has dangerous psychic powers that make him an unpredictable adversary. But I've got just the thing to take him down. This armor is outfitted with a psychic energy disruptor field. Should protect me from whatever Grodd sends my way. Ah, sweet. That'll protect Central City. I better get back to the train. Ow! What the- Give it up, Grodd. Stop this train immediately. You're putting yourself and all commuters at risk. Batman! How did you survive being run over by a train? If I weren't so annoyed, I'd be impressed. Don't worry about it, Grodd. You've got more pressing problems. Your species is full of arrogance. Humans will never best their obvious superiors, the apes! Is that so? I'll prove it to you. Bow to me, foolish human, and then get off my train! You've underestimated me yet again, Grodd. Very well. I guess this will have to do! Like I said, arrogance. I got you, Bats. Ugh, Grodd hits harder than I remember. Hey, looks like you owe me double, friend. Now what? We have to get to the engine and stop this train. Take this. It will protect you from Grodd's telepathy. You always have the best gadgets. No time to lose. Central City will be mine! I don't think so, Grud. The Flash. Now it all makes sense. Why must you constantly interfere with my plans? I guess that's just what heroes do. Like Batman, your pride will be your downfall. Ha! <laughs> nice try. <laughs> hey, Batman, your turn. Ah, I'm on it. <laughs> no!
That takes care of Grodd. No time to lose. We have to stop the train before it reaches Central City. Don't worry, I got you covered. Now approaching Central City Jail. Great job, Flash. I can always count on you. No problemo. <coughs> Another reminder for you, Grodd. Crime doesn't pay. Back to captivity for you. Curse you, humans! Looks like humanity wins this time. Hey, Flash. Can I, uh, borrow some train fare for the trip back to Gotham? Here, you can use my commuter card. I usually travel by foot anyway. Stupid fisherman! I'm gonna bust up every boat I find! Starting with these in Gotham City Harbor! <laughs> <laughs> it's great to see you, Batman. Nothing like a guy's day out to relax and catch up. Agreed. Have I shown you my new fishing rod? <gasps> Put that thing away! See here, old friend. I know fishing is a relaxing activity, but it can be quite traumatic for my aquatic brethren. I never thought about that. Thanks for educating me. Of course. Ignorance is the enemy of understanding, as you know. <sighs> so, what are you in the mood for? Uh-oh. Fun and games may have to wait. Time for action. Ah, puny humans! Run! Flee! Stay away from my Oosnet! Stand down, King Shark. Your reign of terror ends now. Ah! Okay, Batman. You try to talk some sense into King Shark, and while he's distracted, I'll come up from behind and sneak attack. Wait, why do you get to do the attacking? I do the attacking. Because I know a shark's weak point. His nose? I always said you were smart. <laughs> Look out! Now listen here, King Shark. I understand your frustration with commercial fishing, but there are better ways to go about this. Stuff it, Aquaman! I don't got no quarrel with you, but I'll bust you up if I gotta! Is that so? Oh yeah, that's so! Oh. For the record, I'd let you do the attack. Let me? I can be pretty generous when I want to. Gotcha! I'll admit, you're strong. Stronger than you? No, oh, <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. I'm a better swimmer, too. Now you're just being ridiculous. Race you to that reef. You're on. Aquaman's in trouble. Good thing I came prepared with my underwater gear. I win! You nuts, I won! <laughs> Clearly I reached the reef first. Ugh. No more talking! Ow. Batman! <laughs> Thanks for the backup. But I've got everything under control. <laughs> I can see that! <laughs> Enough! I've been holding back, but now I'm going to show you what I'm really made of. You ain't never gonna defeat me! I'm not away! King of the ocean! Well, I'm the king of Atlantis and the king of the Seven Seas. That's two kings. Big whoop. Let's see how great you are. I bet you can't tell me all the species of sharks in the sea. Psst, that's over 500! I can list them all. Carcharodon Carcharius, Galeocero Cuvier, Gingly Mostoma Okay, okay, you know sharks. Go ahead, bet you can't stump me. Here's one. How many hearts does an octopus have? Three. Is coral an animal or a Animal. Plant? What percentage of the earth is covered in water? You're good. Ha, told ya. Can we get back to punching? Hmm. Oh, a sunken fishing boat. Now that gives me an idea. Just as I thought. Looks like I'll get to go fishing today after all. I'll admit it. You're a worthy adversary. And better! I can probably swim deeper than you. Ha! You're on! <laughs> he fell for it! Ugh. Now this boulder will fall on him! 
Take that, King Shark. I can go no deeper than <laughs> Told you I was king of the ocean. And the catch of the day. Oh, Batman. I'll get out of this lousy net easy. Unlikely. That's a titanium reinforced net designed to restrain the strongest of sea creatures, including a giant squid. Come on. Thanks, Batman. But I was fine. King Shark was just about to fall into my trap. I thought I'd save you the trouble, Aquaman. I'll get you next time! What do we do with King Shark? I've got just the idea. <laughs> this will make a terrific fish story. And we don't have to throw him back, either. Why, you little... Okay, Nightwing, let's take a look around. What are we looking for again? There's reports of swamp water being dumped in the Gotham Reservoir. Definitely sounds suspicious. It's a public health issue. The people of Gotham deserve safe drinking water. I'm sure it's nothing we can't handle. Hey, Batman! Looks like this area was recently drained of water. <laughs> Look out, Nightwing! Solomon Grundy! <laughs> Who would have thought? I always knew you were a swamp dweller. <laughs> Back off, Grundy. I don't know what you're up to, but I'm putting a stop to it. Uh-oh. I'm sinking. Hey, Batman! Could you hurry it up over there? Grundy, how many times do I have to tell you to stay out of my swamp? You don't say much, do you? Swamp thing. Perfect timing. Hang on, Nightwing. I'll use the grappling hook on the battle bike to get you out. Don't worry. I'm not going anywhere. Hey, Swamp Thing! Hey, Nightwing. <sighs> that should do it. Thanks for the help, friend. Grundy is a tough customer. This swamp is no slouch either. Say, you know anything about swamp water being dumped in the Gotham Reservoir? It probably has something to do with a recent shift in the water tank. <laughs> We have to think fast. Grundy is too big and slow to get me. But we're not going to be able to get close enough with this oh, with this tree in the way. They'll wear us out eventually. Play time's over, Grundy. This ends now. Follow my lead, Nightwing. Let's drop this guy. Consider him dropped. Thanks, Swamp Thing. I like having you on our side. Don't worry about the reservoir, Batman. I can take care of it myself. <gasps> that leaves us to take care of Solomon Grundy. Yeah, by taking him to prison. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like Grundy is saving us the trip. Do we need to get him out of there? No need. Grundy's neither alive nor dead. He's just where he belongs. All right, let's go. See you back at the Batcave? Not if I see you first. Ah! Oh no! He's back! <laughs> That's the problem with the undead. They keep getting back up. Don't worry, Batman. I've got this. Yeah! <sighs> Great work, Nightwing. Thanks. But what are we gonna do about the Batmobile? <laughs> and roadside assistance to my resume. I don't see any roads around. Whew. Thanks again, Swamp Thing. That's twice I owe you. Anytime. What about Grundy? 
Let's tie him to the roof for easy transport. You're all set. See you next time, Swampy. You've got it. What the? Oh, good grief. Swamp Thing, are you still there? I need a hand. Swampy? Hello?